हेलो डियर स्टूडेंट्स तो आज हम देखेंगे ऑन विंग्स ऑफ करेज दैट इज 1.3 1.3 के विंग्स ऑफ करेज में हमें देखना है अ स्टोरी ऑफ द इंडियन एयर फोर्स ऑफिसर ओके इस स्टोरी को जब हम देखेंगे तो वी शेल सी सो मेनी थिंग्स ऑफ इट मींस द एंटायर करियर ऑफ द पर्सन एंड हिज कंट्रीब्यूशन टू वर्ड्स द नेशन एज सच बट बिफोर we actually move for that i would like to take you to this warming up session because see when the syllabus that has been framed long back so the syllabus is not framed on the basis of simply giving you the stories and all but once again i uh, tell you the very thing that we learn certain stories we learn the biographies we learn the autobiographies we learn the short stories and what not just in order to uh learn the cross cutting issues including humanities uh then uh, professional ethics then gender sensitivity and the things as such to isme aaj hame dekhna hai ki what is there in the warming up session it's very simple actually so today's warming up session is the simplest kind of warming up session as such so there are certain things given the ranks of officers in indian army navy and air force are jumbled up you know they have been written as a whole they are in one box so in this box all the officers from this indian army excuse me indian army then navy and air force they have been jumbled up here so what you need to do aapko kya karna hai ki in officers jo ek sath rakhe gaye hai teenon wings mein se तो अपने अपने विंग्स में उन ऑफिसर्स के नाम आपको डाल दे डिस्कस विद योर ग्रुप एंड पुट देम इन द अप्रोप्रिएट बॉक्सेस सो यू विल हैव टू पुट देम इन द अप्रोप्रिएट बॉक्सेस दिस एक्सरसाइज आई विल नॉट डू फॉर यू एट ऑल नो दिस इज व्हाट यू हैव टू डू यू हैव टू डू योर ओन एक्सरसाइज इट्स मी टू टेल यू ओनली दैट हाउ द एक्सरसाइज कैन बी डन फॉर एग्जांपल कमांडर कमांडर वेयर डू वी फाइंड कमांडर do we find commander in army or in navy or in air force all right so let us move for the more important warming up session and that warming up session includes homophones and homographs so what are the homophones homophone make sentences to bring out the difference between where and where where and where so these are the homophones as such or homographs we call them here and here there and there sail and sail only four things are given why they are called the homophones let us have the look at this thing that these things are called the homophones because their spellings are different okay their spellings are different and even their meanings are different but the pronunciations are the same so spellings spellings are different meanings are different but the pronunciations pronunciations are the same ye yahan par different hai aur iske jo pronunciation hai lekin wo same hai for example just see we are Where, so where, where, here, here, there, there, sail, sail. Miss, if you simply look at the very things, तो बस देखते ही साथ हमारी समझ में आ जाता है कि इसका मतलब अलग है और इसका मतलब अलग है. All right, इनके spellings भी अलग हैं, लेकिन उनका pronunciation that is the same way okay then here this is again here there there and then we say sell sell so these are called the homophones or homographs as such thoda aage badhenge aur dekhenge ki in cheezon ko kaise samjha ja sakta hai so what is there in write what the underlined homographs in the following sentence mean ये जो अंडरलाइन होमोग्राफ्स हैं इनके मीनिंग क्या होते हैं 
ये हमको बताना है सो वॉट इज दैट अबियर इज एन ऑमनीवरस एनिमल अबियर इज एन ऑमनीवरस हियर इज अगेन बियर एंड हियर इज अगेन द बियर ओके बैट बैट फाइन फाइन एंड देन वी हैव फेयर फेयर सो दीज आर द होमोग्राफ्स होमोफोन्स फोन्स मीन्स फोनिक प्रोनाउंसिएशंस जो सेम होते हैं होमो मीन्स द सेम ओके एंड ग्राफ मीन्स द राइटिंग सो राइटिंग ऑफ बियर एंड बियर इज द सेम बैट एंड बैट सेम फाइन एंड फाइन सेम फेयर एंड फेयर सेम बट देर मीनिंग्स आर डिफरेंट इन द होमोफोन्स वी फाउंड दैट द मीनिंग्स आर डिफरेंट स्पेलिंग्स आर डिफरेंट बट प्रोनाउंसिएशन आर द सेम हियर वी फाइंड दैट स्पेलिंग्स आर सेम प्रोनाउंसिएशंस आर सेम बट मीनिंग्स आर डिफरेंट सो हियर वी फाइंड ओनली एट मीनिंग लेवल द डिफरेंस बिटवीन द टू वर्ड्स एज सच सो अ बियर इज एन ऑमनीवरस एनिमल नो और शी कुड नॉट बियर द इनजस्टिस so you have to write something of it here in the blank space as such so what is the meaning of the first beer and what is the meaning of the second beer that is importantly to be pointed out what is the meaning of bad here and what is the meaning of bad in the second sentence a bat is the only bird which is a mammal and his bat broke as it struck the ball so bat you know as a mammal here taken bat as a mammal here taken and bat against the ball so you better understand these are very small things we generally see but my personal opinion to you is that you must take this warming up session very sincerely because warming warming up session makes your mind and also checks your mind whether things you understand or not because believe or not but you are the students of 10th standard right and you generally think your studies in terms of examination so examinations mein sabse important kya hota hai instructions or we can say instructions or we can say questions and answers so these instructions when they are given to you write what the underlined homographs in the following sentences mean or jo bhi humne aage dekha tha make sentences to bring about to bring out the difference between or to say see certain things sorry the ranks of officers in indian army navy and air forces are jumbled up discuss with group this is an instruction for you discuss with your group and put them in the appropriate boxes so very few things are there if you can do this you can better learn things that is uh, on wings of courage so we shall see the same then in the next lecture as such and we'll finish the lesson uh, definitely so thank you very much agar aapko hamara channel acha lagta hai to zaruri se like kare share kare comment kare aur सब्सक्राइब करना बिल्कुल ना भूलें एंड मोर इम्पॉर्टेंटली प्रेस द बेल आइकन थैंक यू